Laren may not be famous for her patience, but Laren understands process. She appreciates it. She values it. And she's willing to do the work. She's always willing to do the work. This is a trait she gets from Andy Hester, a trait she gets from her mother, a trait she shares with Sean. On the Hester side, we've had half a decade or so to get to know who Sean is and what he's about. When we talk to him and Laren about their relationship, when we observe them in action, we know, or rather we feel, what it means for two people to be willing to work with and for each other. He's been a great teammate and a great friend to me. You learn a lot about someone when you're playing together on the field, and uh, Shawnee is definitely a person that you want in your corner. Love is brilliant. It creates a great confusion that turns impossible dreams into accessible realities. Marriage, on the other hand, not always brilliant. There will be days, a lot of days, when you have to figure out whether you even like the person to whom you've pledged your undying love. One of the few things I believe unequivocally is that Laren and Sean will always be willing to do the work. I, Sean, take you, Laren, to be my wife. I, Laren, take you, Sean, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you. In good times and in bad. In sickness and in health. To love you and to honor you. All the days of my life. All the days of my life. I'd like to introduce to you, for the first time, as a sacramentally bound couple, Sean and Laren. Laren, so friendly, so warm, you just fit right in and uh, you make him happier than I've ever seen him at home, so you're doing something right. <laughs> I said to Evelyn, I think this is a match. And she says, I told you several times that Sean will wait until he happen on the right person. And Sean is here today with that right person. May the hard work always be worth it, but may the need to do the work be ever so rare.